Cool. Don't cry on this episode. Some of you might recognise this place. It's a little bit unkept from back in the day, back in when I was in high school. Graduated 2012. <sighs> okay. Sorry for the wind noise. I'm here in Cambridge. Just to talk to you guys. Oh, this is gonna be really fucking hard. So, a couple weeks ago, I found out that a good friend had passed away. He lost his battle with depression. It fucking sucks. Because we've all been there, I'm pretty sure. There's not a single person on this earth that goes through life all happy chappy. It's impossible unless you're on crack. Where am I going? I guess I'll go this way. Yeah, so. That fucking sucks that that happened to my good friend Michael. He was such an awesome dude. And it shouldn't have happened. And I'm still in shock. Even though it happened a couple of weeks ago. I really didn't want to believe that it was him in that coffin. But it fucking was. So I guess it's a little bit of a wake-up call for me and for all the good friends that were at the funeral and um, I think we have kind of learnt to maybe check up on each other because we don't want to go through that again. <sighs> Me and Michael went to the spot one time. <sighs> so, I guess I'm here for him. <sighs> I hate depression. It sucks. There is the view of Cambridge. Wait, where is Cambridge? I think it's over there. <sighs> Fuck. And I know my good friend Renee. She went to like care bearer for Mike. So I guess this is my little tribute. And I think, yeah, we all just need to, I guess, learn to keep in touch with old friends, check on friends, no matter if they're just mates. <sighs> yeah, I recited what I was going to say, but I guess I've forgotten what it was. Shit. Sorry about this, guys. I guess I got the- my emotions have gotten the better of me today. <sighs> it's so quiet up here, though. It's good to get out of the city. Even though Hamilton's not that big, but it's just nice and bloody quiet. 
It's nice to go somewhere fucking quiet. But yeah, for you guys, if you need to talk to anybody, feel free to chat to me even on my social media. And it's not much. I mean, you can't really do much over text, but um, this is the least I could do if you need to chat. Or some of you guys know me in person, you can just Facebook me if you're having a shit time. Yeah, so I would rather hear about your situation than hear about your eulogy. Because I do not want to go to another fucking funeral. Give <laughs> me some peace, Mike. Sorry for such a downer video, <laughs> but I feel like it needs to be addressed. Mental health is a serious problem in New Zealand, and we've got no support, I think. just It just doesn't... I don't know. I feel like no one really gets the help they need. So, speak up. Let you, you let yourself be heard. Better out than in, I always say. That's a quote from Shrek, isn't it? Yeah. But anyway. <sighs> I feel like I could talk to you guys. And this shit doesn't, I don't know. <sighs> Just aches my heart that he had to go like that but I hope that he's in a better place but for all you guys that are watching please don't go that route suicide is um, a freaking it's only a permanent solution to a temporary problem. There is a fucking way out. I know there is. I've been there. I almost did. Once. But, because I had support, awesome friends, awesome family, I made it out. So, don't let the darkness get you, man. It's not worth it. You've got your whole life to enjoy. So do it. Live your fucking best life. Okay, I think that's all from me, man. <sighs> Again, sorry for the down buzz, but that needed to be said. So yeah. Either learn from what's happened and what I'm saying. I don't know what, if I'm making any sense. Uh, but yeah. I just squished a bug. That's nasty. Okay. I hate the question that comes into my mind. Um, like, what if I knew? What if I could help Michael? Could there have been a different outcome or could he still be alive? Well the answer is most likely yes, but we can't change what's happened in the past. We can only learn from it. So all of us that are watching right now, learn from it. Keep moving forward. Just keep moving forward. Shit will get better. I assure you. Just don't go killing yourself, guys. Please. We don't need that. Rest in peace, Mike. Searching for a trail to follow again
Take me back to the night we met Then that I can tell myself What the hell I'm supposed to do Then that I can tell myself Not to ride along with you I hate all and then most of you Some and now none of you Take me back When the night 